what is going on people welcome back to another video on the diy car gas channel so in today's video we're going to be looking at this dell laptop which is coming up with an issue blue screen and it says inaccessible boot device which i'll show you right now once it loads up so we're going to be going through how to fix that very very simple guys so as you guys can see i've just switched it on it is loading up right now and you would see it coming up with the blue screen so we'll just wait for that whilst we're waiting make sure to hit that subscribe button and like the video guys and also if there are any other issues that you guys are facing with these dell laptops whatever it is let me know in the comment section down below and i'll be sure to put a troubleshooting guide to that as well so as you guys can see secured with dell safe bios so why did this come up for me is because i was imaging the laptop and as you guys can see your device ran into a problem and needs to restart will restart for you and the stop code is inaccessible boot device so what are we doing now so again i didn't press anything at the moment the laptop is shutting down and booting back up by itself is going to try an automatic repair but majority of the time it will fail so then it will give you two options to either diagnose the pc or shut it down so what we're going to do is yes choose the layout as united kingdom we're not going to troubleshoot we're going to turn off the pc so what we're going to do now is turn it back on and press so press the power on and keep pressing f12 guys so keep pressing this key here f12 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 and it should come up with this screen here so what you want to do now if you go into bios setup and once you go into there it should come up with this screen here so what you then want to do is go into storage once you go into storage well depending on where it is it's either on disabled ahci or radon so what you want to do is click on this one here so mine is currently on radon what, I want, what i'm going to do is click here on ahci and vme so as you guys can see i've clicked it on there warning changing the setting may prevent you from operating system or require reinstall i sure you would like to continue press yes so as you guys can see it has now selected this one and apply changes at the bottom apply changes and press ok are you sure you want to apply yep so once that's done press exit and it should essentially just reboot itself and shouldn't come up with an error message it should straight away just go back to the main screen so as you guys can see it's currently booting back up i didn't press anything it shuts down takes a few seconds and boots back up so as you guys can see it's currently loading up so we'll wait and see so if it does work it should just go straight to the login screen which we will see right now guys so let me know in the comment section down below if this has worked for you and if it hasn't let me know guys and i'll be making more videos on how to do this as you guys can see getting device ready 21 percent, 25 percent. so already we can see it booting up it is getting it ready not like what we saw previously so we are on the right path right now and we just need to wait for it to literally just load back up i'm not going to cut this video i'm literally just going to wait and as you guys can see it has loaded back up you can literally carry on using it as normal so guys this is how to come or go past that issue an accessible boot device if this has helped you make sure to subscribe like share and comment and i'll catch you guys in my next video until then take care and peace